Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another edition of Rock's Garage. I'm your host, Dan, and on today's episode, we're gonna be installing part number SEAT-590, which is our trunk or cooler kit for our 500 series seat kits. Now, before we get started, let's take a look at everything that comes in that kit and the tools we're gonna need for the installation. So when you receive your kit, you're going to get your storage container, and you're also going to get your latch kit and your bag of hardware. So now that we've taken a look at everything that comes in the kit, let's take a look at the tools we're gonna need to perform the installation. So in order to get this install done, we only need a few simple tools. So we have a cordless drill with a Phillips head attachment, a handheld Phillips head screwdriver, as well as a flathead screwdriver for a pry tool. And now, as always, we just wanna go over a few safety precautions before we get started. So first, we wanna make sure that we turn our cart off. Then we're gonna set our parking brake. And if we have an electric cart, we're gonna flip the tow run switch to the tow position. Now the first step in our installation process is we need to flip our flip deck on our seat kit out of the way so that we can access the access panel. So in order to remove our access panel, we need to remove the two screws that hold the panel down underneath of the flip deck. Those screws are located in the back corners of the flip deck, so we can go ahead and remove those. And then once those are removed, we can remove the center cap as well and remove the access panel and move it out of the way. So now that our access panel is out of the way, we can go ahead and drop the cooler into place and install it. So we're gonna go ahead and drop it right into the hole on the cart. So now with the cooler resting in the seat kit, we're gonna go ahead and attach it using the provided hardware on the four outermost holes of the cooler. Now keep in mind that the holes on the outside of the flip deck are there for drainage purposes and not for the install. So now with the cooler itself installed, we can go ahead and install our latch into our access panel. In order to do that, we need to take the two bolts out of the latch itself so that we can clamp it onto the access panel. So the latch side is going to go into the top part of the access panel, and then you're gonna take the bottom part, and install it just like that, and then reinstall your hardware. So once you've installed your latch, that's gonna do it for the install for part number SCEAT-590, which is our cooler and storage kit for our 500 series seat kits. Thanks for watching this episode of Rock's Garage. Stay safe and I'll see you guys next time.